Squint Jr. How to play. The object of the game is to earn the most scoring chips. Spread the shape cards face up on the table so all the cards can be seen. Place all the components on the table. Choose a player to be the first builder. Place the card viewer in front of the builder so only the builder can see the picture. On your turn, you move the visible card to the back of the card viewer. Silently read the word of the new visible card without another player seeing it. When you're ready, someone flips the timer. You have 30 seconds to take shape cards and combine them together so another player can guess what you're building. Other than saying yes, no, hot, cold, you are not allowed to talk. But you may tell players which direction your building is facing. The builder may point to an area of the building to help the guessers. You may not point to anything other than what you are building. Players get infinite guesses to figure out what you're building. The builder and the first player to guess correctly each receive one scoring chip. Then the next player clockwise to the builder becomes the new builder. If no one guesses correctly when the time runs out, then no one receives chips and the next player takes their turn. A round is complete when each player has had one turn as the builder. With three or four players, the game ends after three rounds. With five to six players, end after two rounds. With seven to eight players, end after one round. The player with the most chips at the end of the game wins. If there is a tie, then the tied players face off in a guessing of a picture from the builder who is next in turn but is not one of the tied players. Some variations of the game include Squint Jr. Light. Don't use the timer. Squint Jr. Expert. Don't look at the picture of the word, but instead use whatever cards you desire to build that item however you like so players can guess it. 